So Crosscode is currently in 0.9.8 and has about half the story out. So this means that the next major update will be the 1.0.0 and will draw back everyone who's been waiting for this story to be finally complete. I'm here for all of you that made it to the end of the beta story and need a quick catcher upper because the beta ended on a very heavy cliffhanger that I don't want to clip because I might not have the clip. That's none of your business. This is the final spoiler warning. Get out if you don't want to be spoiled. Stay in if you've been spoiled already. Let's go. The game starts with you playing as Shizuka, who is a player who is talking to a silhouette in a box. It's in a box. Shizuka is a high level player who can easily wipe the floor with presumably the most powerful non unique monsters in the game and also has tier 3 arts. She finally gets to the man she's after, named Satoshi, just in time for him to tell her two important things that we all need to remember when we're going into 1.0.0. I told you about the agreement, I finished this, and they let you go. So he was writing some sort of code or something in exchange of Shizuka's freedom, and writing this code somehow killed him. Then his final words were an apology for dragging her into this, and a request of just promise me that you will get away, please. And he died. This brings us to the man that pretends to be a deity, calls himself We, and lacks social boundaries, because he snatches you up and makes you fight a giant crab. You get away, but just barely, meet a bonjour bonjour baguettes and sidekick Schneider, and first learn about the ancients. No, I didn't forget about him, and yes, you got called a cheater by some weird person. I really liked his song, so here it is. The Ancients. Very old race, you're trying to discover more about them. That's basically it. Their equipment has persevered for a lot of years, so we kinda wanna see how the equipment works. Alright. You then went on to beat the Bergen Dungeon, in which you got rewarded with a lesson about shapes. I'm not kidding. Each of these players talked about a shape except for one that talked about a fire that wanted to be a shape. That's the very dumbed down version. I don't think this is very important. You then move on to the brace of chads. I mean shads. And they tell you that the ancients were their distant relatives and that they want to learn more about them too so of course they're gonna team up with the seekers whose entire goal is to find out more about their ancestors. And then she sends you to a tree to fight a bunch of maggots. Again, not kidding, if you don't remember, that actually happened. You did that. You slew the maggots! And then you made your way into the dungeon, you beat probably the hardest boss in the game so far, and then you exited out the backside and got more of these rotating bricks that I actually didn't even care to read this time like I'm making a recap I should have at least read it but this leads us to the very end of the story so far where you're about to go into a dungeon with the guild you joined a while back you already probably remember that so I didn't recap it at all and technically what happened in the dungeon never happened so yeah you're at the gates of the dungeon waiting for 1.0.0 oh yeah also you have amnesia how can I forget that I'm gonna keep this very brief. Brilliant. <laughs> so there you have it. Now you're completely back up to date with CrossCode. And now you can play 1.0.0 if you're watching this post-release of 1.0.0. If not, then patience. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.